<laughs> All right, so super fast start of this series. We have our beautiful Eprotas player rocking that remastered Nexus. For Team Void, this is Kasparos. And fighting for the Terran race, we have in the bottom right, Captain Fish. Representing, I guess it's his own clan, the Fish Clan. <laughs> the Fish Clan. <laughs> It's a fishing clan, you know? It's like, back in the day, like, the tribes. One of them was, like, a hunting tribe. The other one's, like, a, a fighting tribe, a fishing tribe, you know? Like... Okay, okay. Maybe maybe he's, See, like, a, a fishing I was thinking of it more one. like he is a fish, you know? Maybe, like, I don't know, like, he's a... He's, a, he's Captain Fish. Like, yeah, Captain Hook, to... he's Captain Fish. Yeah, I'm trying to deduct, like, what this... Um banner does you know like what what does this mean like what what is this i'm, I'm not it's sure. a disc some Dude, character do you see the the little green dot in the bottom right side of it yeah oh it's, that is it's yeah. discord <laughs> imagine okay. having a discord profile picture cut out in a square <laughs> PVT at the time, please. <laughs> Prometheus, thank you for the follow. Welcome, welcome, welcome. <laughs> Let's go, fish. Oh, there we go. Somebody cheering for Captain Fish. Good to see. Okay, finally, we have a scout coming in. And we're going to have the, the Reaper moving across the map. Let's follow it. And Twilight on the way. So, uh, I would guess by the looks of it, it's going to be a super standard opener with a blink, uh, blink opener. Whoever did the shout out to Mr. Ace, thank you so much. I have a small, small bet. If you want to do it, I I will bet that it's it's Samuel. I would actually bet like I don't know. Um, <laughs> Is he lurking in the chat here? <laughs> probably. There's a minute delay, so we, we won't yeah. know but until a minute from well, now, we but will, yes, we will <laughs> know. probably. We'll know in, in time. <laughs> <laughs> but thank you, thank you. Yep, Blink is on the way, so it will be Blink. Starport as well. Widow Mine coming up, so maybe Widow Mine drop? That would be cool. Yep. Also, let me just fairly standard, but I do always like to see it regardless. Widow Mines are an exciting unit. Where's the prediction? I don't know. Where's the prediction? I don't know. I, we should make predictions, honestly. Oh. But would people actually do uh, predictions? Because. There is a there is an issue whenever I do predictions people don't predict people are lurking so Yeah, okay, so we're Maybe going just to have the, uh, semis and finals. Uh, yeah, we could do that We could definitely do that. I'm going to to forget so maybe if you remember <laughs> I'm already abusing <laughs> the fact that there's someone more here who else would it be? I don't know. Like, there he is. <laughs> what? What of the? What of the other six billion moderators that I have? I don't know. Maybe that I wish to have in like six trillion years. Ooh. And I would still call you the moderator. You know. <laughs> that's that's how it goes, Samuel. At this point, like. I think, I think the, I, at least I hope so. At least I hope uh, whenever you will stop moderating my, my Twitch channel, it's going to be when I literally stop streaming. <laughs> yeah. Buckle up, oh. Ace. We're going to be here for the next uh, three millennia. Because <laughs> I ain't giving up. Okay. So double mind drop oh, here. We don't mind. 
Yeah, yeah. yeah. We have Blink. I was waiting for so... him to keep sending that. We have Blink, and now this uh, lack the of observer like, is about to finish too. Yeah, this lack of execution actually managed to to get the observer out, and both mines are actually going to drop here. Nicely done here. Okay, boop, boop. that's only two mines. Two probes. That's two mines for two probes, most likely. Oh, he's gonna pick them up. Nice. Nicely done here. Uh, no charge on the way, so I suspect. Yeah, I was gonna say I suspect uh, Blink Colossus to be the follow up. No, this is not that many stalkers. Uh, let's be honest. Like these will be able to kite, but but this is not going to be anything That's super too scary of a force. Yeah. I okay, he's killing the rocks. Yeah. It's not going to be like super, super committed. He will not blink onto the tank and everything. So, yeah. Colossus is on the way. That yeah. I'd like to see. Ace, Samo asked us, how are we today? Well, Samo, I am fine. Thank you I'm very much. I'm doing pretty good. Yeah, I am really good. I'm happy to to cast a lot of Starcraft. I'm kind of getting used to my, my weekends actually being fulfilled with Starcraft and, and I don't mind it at all. I, gaming has been a... Uh, a real a real passion for me all over the years so i'm glad that i can actually just you know share the passion with someone whoa whoa <laughs> those yeah. stalkers were so lucky that that tank was on yeah CG right literally then. On CG. <laughs> <laughs> like, it was literally in reach i was like looking at it and i'm like uh wait oh the tank is I on CG. Those stalkers <laughs> coming back in i was like whoa, whoa what are you doing <laughs> <laughs> those are like red hp stalkers you know some of them lack shield some of them lack hp another stalker joins the fray how are you doing samo not, not sure what this stalker force is really going to do here though oh oh okay, okay. oh Wait, All right. it's it's uh, like the more it's morning for you, Samo, no? I, I think it's in the morning for you. Somewhere in the morning. Shave off some shields for the uh, damage on the tank, but it just gets repaired right away. Yeah, that's actually good reaction from Captain Fish, just repairing it. Okay. Uh, third base is already saturated. Oh, four bases on the way. Okay, that's great. Uh, Captain Fish could drop another, a couple, potentially a couple uh, production facilities. So we're gonna have plus one infantry finishing, but not plus one armor. Although plus two uh, could start because we have a second uh, eBay as well. Okay, bit of a micro war here. Oh, but he walks back in. I think it was like um, on a move. He blinked backward and, and he was on a move. Both players powering up here. Disruptors on the way. I like to see that. Yeah, was we have two colossi. We uh, have? Yeah, air weapons. So I would suspect. Yeah. yeah, there we go. Vikings and later on, Liberators will benefit from that as well. If we get there oh they do okay i didn't actually i wasn't sure about that i wasn't sure if the liberator oh you're referring to the anti-air attack or do they also benefit with the ground uh, do attack they benefit for the from the for the ground attack because it literally it just you okay. know um uses the the ground attack as far as i know uh, sorry not the ground attack like uh it uses like one uh damage type for like, it, it doesn't separate it, like, back in Brood War, I believe. Yeah, I just couldn't remember if the Liberator uh, ground attack was actually a spell. You know what I mean? Like, it, certain certain attacks are, oh like, considered uh, a spell. I think, spell, like, BC but still it's not, have... I don't think. BC still have, like, separate anti-air and anti-ground, right? Something like that. And Queens have, like, uh, different believe, range. Yeah, they do. Yeah, yeah. Okay. No, but I mean, uh, the upgrades applying to it. Okay. Oh, oh, oh. Couple of marauders get That's taken down. Crazy. The medevac full of stuff was taken down. Now there's like a single medevac with, and and a full medevac. That's pretty much it. Three marauders, two uh, marines, Kasparos and two medevacs. Is being a fantastic Protoss player here. He's slightly behind, so he's dropping the dark shrine. Oh, <laughs> I don't even Protoss know if play. it's like it, it's like slightly behind, you know? Because look at the tech. Look at tech wise. I'm just memeing. <laughs> uh, although it's 15 marauders and 30 marines, so I, yeah, he's behind, and he has eight mines. Captain Fish has eight mines. I just looked at the supply, and I was like, oh, okay, I can make the joke. <laughs> joke is valid. <laughs> yeah, 
it's like when slightly behind, when slightly ahead, when <laughs> massively far, uh, far ahead or far behind, doesn't matter. Dark Shrine all day, every day. Oh, Ooh. that was a bit of a shot there, but not that crazy. Didn't blow up like half of the army, as Terrence do, yeah. do say about it. Okay, Spotter Pylon getting taken down. Now, we don't have that many upgrades on the side of Captain Fish, so the upgrades are for now sort of on the on the the Protoss favor, favoring the Protoss right now. Okay, he's gonna move in. That's a lot of Colossi shots that can go down. Oh, oh wow! Gets three on Colossi, top of yeah. Him, but uh, still cannot finish them off. I'm not sure that was worth it. Yeah, by the looks of it, it wasn't at all worth it because he traded his whole army for like two Colossi, a Disruptor, yeah. and maybe a couple of Gateway units. So it's absolutely not worth it. Obviously, you don't really want to do I, this. You know, I feel like he kind of sacrificed economy to really get that attack rolling in the first place because now we've got a pretty significant worker lead for Protoss. Although, you know, Terran does have mules. Uh, I don't think it makes up for, for this many workers. Especially uh, yeah. that <laughs> you need scans because DTs are going to come into to play right now. That is also very moments. true. I'm just waiting like for a ghost on the way for Captain uh, Fish. I believe so. Yes, the Ghost Academy. I saw the Ghost Academy being dropped uh, at some point. So he has four in production right now. Yeah, so he has the four tech labs, which is quite nice. Actually, he has five Ooh, tech labs because oh. he has a Marauder. Yeah, that was oh my god, that was crazy. Oh, the Catching whole army chases the, the medevac. That's not the correct call, Mr. Kasparos. But he has the fifth base, I guess. Uh, sorry. Oh, that's... Oh, dude, that's already the sixth base. Protoss is massively ahead. When massively <laughs> ahead, go Dark Shrine. Yeah. <laughs> the joke's turn. <laughs> and now the DT just does the great, great sprint across the map. From the sixth base to the fourth. Okay. Is there anything here to spot? Was there a turret there? I don't think there was. Man, if if it, it would actually like hide a bit more. Oh, wait. <laughs> the fight oh. is commencing. I was going to say if the DT would hide a bit uh, further, Ooh. it would be like hiding in the shadows. <laughs> oh, let's see. My nice shots. little mines on the Archons. Nice. He took down one of those Archons, but these Archons are quite beefy. Actually, one of them actually lost uh, pretty much all the shields, but nine. Well, that was actually a pretty good engagement for Captain Fish there. I'm still really concerned about the economy, though. Yeah, the economy looks... Uh, well, I'm sorry for saying it like this, but looks kind of poo-poo over here. Don't want to say... <laughs> uh, it lo looks kind of shit! Oh, oh it's <laughs> Ah... Uh, so many of the mine just got go taken off. out for free there. Yeah. Yeah, there's a lot of uh, Vikings, so uh, these... And now gonna get he doesn't have volley? the zoning power to really yeah. keep this army at bay here, I don't think. If I knew the Liberators gonna come in play. Ramp, put up the Liberators, yeah. He needs to wait for 3-3 three, three and plus 2 Liberators. Uh, plus 2 Libs will 2-shot Stalkers. It's going to be kind of the late game timing. He needs to wait for that. But the problem is, oh. the more he waits... The more the Protoss has a, the chance to actually transition into air and stuff like that, so... Oh, repair is not gonna be in time. Or not in, in time, oh. but not enough, actually. And there was no cancel on that CC. Wait, wasn't the finished CC? It was a finished CC. No, there was another CC he was oh, building right next to it. Oh, the other one, it. yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. And... Oh, the shopping ball oh. from downtown. Oh, no, the one! Oh, no! Oh, no! <laughs> <laughs> oh that was absolute... Painful shot for Captain Fish. It's gonna be the, the mines back though, and with the libs, I feel like if he were to try to move up and take control of that uh, line of sight blocker there, he might be able to pressure that nexus. I'm pretty sure he could do that. Yeah. Hey, imagine he could the also stalkers pressure would want that to... corner base if he knew that it was there. I don't think he knows it's there. Yeah, I don't think so. don't don't think so either. Okay, don't think so either. Don't 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 don't. He could even just send a couple of marauders down there and stim it down nine gateways on the way we're gonna go up to 18 gateways we're gonna have mature gateway numbers oh nice blink avoiding oh, the widow mine shots disruptor taking out two mines yeah 
Uh, could have been ghosts three, want to get a nice EMP? Oh, oh, oh. No, oh, but those that three ghosts huge. potentially. Was but it does though? he have the army ready like to engage? He has engage. to retreat. Oh, but the disruptor, disruptor, disruptor. Okay, he's gonna disruptors get... are not ready. It's gonna get taken down. Do we have more disruptor shots ready? Yeah, the batteries are gonna recharge that army there. Okay, we have two disruptor balls. Let's go balling. Says the Protoss. Oh, Libs wanted the siege, but a little far forward. Ooh, that's actually nice snipe on one of those liberators. Can we take that mine shot? Nice. Another EMP. Gets most of the Protoss army there. Yeah, the ghosts are going to play an integral part. Especially because oh. uh, if they take down the, the shields, it's going to be quite easy to deal with those uh, stalkers. Do hey, we without have... stalkers, you cannot There is no advanced blitz. ballistics. Oh, yeah. Oh, we have a bit of a, a drop here in the, the top right side, but nothing of value has been done there. Man, 16 minutes in, and I have no idea who's actually winning because both players are maxed out. Although Kasparos has a uh, really, really good bank, a really healthy bank. Obviously has this base over here, started to mine it. And we know how it works. The more you mine it, the, the faster it will mine out. And the faster it will mine out, the less your opponent can have a chance to actually get it. Okay, bit of a run by. Let's see... Yeah, if this really goes to the late game, where the exhaust of bases oh. is important. Okay, Ooh. this and tank could go down. Yeah. Oh. Tank it's going to be fallen. really important. Oh, that was the last tank as well. Like, it could have been quite nice. Oh, if he actually controlled that ball. Oh, but oh, this oh, could be good. Oh. Couple of marauders. Giving me a heart attack. Nice EMPs once again. Oh, my God. Oh, wow. oh that's a nicer one. He's actually going to push forward, but does he oh, have no! enough? Oh! Oh! No! oh my god, he played with fire and he got burned. Oh my god. And see, the problem here is Captain Fish, is, it's really like a three base style versus a four base style here. You know, we've got the 60 worker economy versus like 82 workers. You yeah. Know? It's not efficient. And having a larger army supply, you know, that could get you an advantage that you could use to push forward. DTs, but DTs, DTs, so moving in, he's moving in, no scan, the scan uh -huh. is late. Do we even have a scan? Oh, he has to run away, he's gonna take down the bunker. Oh my god, he's gonna kill off everything over here. And now the panic can be induced. Oh, he's actually going to get cleaned oh up god. there. Oh, he needs to be careful not to sacrifice these DTs for nothing. There's 13 this workers chaos, falling. Oh, and the Protoss is moving in on that side too. No, oh, it's actually not bad at all. Oh, 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 just... <laughs> oh my god, this is nasty. The multitasking on the Protoss side is actually quite nice. Kasparos is just trying yeah, his did. best. Oh, he, another... he is gasping for air on the beach here, I think. Yeah. This is not looking good. My God, yeah, this is, this this fish is not in water right now. He's no. he's struggling. He's like he, in a he's, little he's puddle. He's flopping around. He's oh no. He's in a little puddle, just trying to like you know, as you said, gasp for air, literally. Well, not air for like water. I don't know what what do these gasp for like. The minerals. Minerals. <laughs> yes, and minerals. workers. And workers. He's gasping for minerals. Oh my God, the turbo repair. Oh. oh no. <laughs> Oh, you're bullying okay. game, not, not the bridge. Oh! Oh my god! This wouldn't oh, be like game ending, but at this point... How many disruptors are we looking at right here? Uh, eight? What? Eight disruptors? That's like, you know, a ball every... every how many seconds? <laughs> uh, oh, it sends out two! <laughs> or not it sends enough. out two, and that's it. <laughs> my you god. had it off. <laughs> <laughs>